Johnson by nature. That's a genius. That's a scholar. I'm a champ. Let's go. Who got it? So, I want to give a rest in peace to young rapper PMB Rock. Lost his life, you know, just recently. Got shot down at Roscoe's. Man, we've been hearing all kind of back and forth about why this young man was murdered. Um, I know he was up and coming. I know that he actually had a lot of positive things to say. And it seems like when the brothers of the new generation got a good buzz, a good rap, and got a good thing to say, they get taken out. So we've heard a lot of things about why, and I want to hear y'all perspective on, on some of those things. Well, I mean, b- before I get to this, the perspective on why, how, whatever, I didn't like how Charleston White did what he did and said what he said. No doubt. You know, we've talked, we've had, we've, we've talked about Charleston White and how we don't rock with how he get down. Let, let me say this, homie. I've never heard of this guy till yesterday. Fuck, I'm on nobody's death for. His death don't mean nothing to me. Nigga, everybody know if you go to California, California been killing rappers forever, homie. They killed Tupac, they killed Biggie. So, nigga, so, so what? PMB died. Fuck him. And so what he said, calling him, you know, saying basically saying, fuck, oh boy, that's not cool, man. That's a, that's a, that's a young brother that lost his life, senseless murder, for no reason. You know? So, I, let, I mean, we want to go there first. Like, fuck you, man. That ain't cool, man. For real. Um... Now, you know, they said he was with his girl, all right, and his girl made, they, allegedly, the girl posted the location. Some say he posted the location. Some say he didn't want to be there. Man, I'm telling you right now, you got to be careful around these parts, man. You stick out like a sore thumb. You know he dripped out. Yep. So, I mean, you know what I'm saying? You dripped out. You know he's driving nice. You know, you, you, you know the culture of our people. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But why though? Man. Why is that the culture of our people? Man. Why why is that why why is we bred like that to be so envious and jealous? Mm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Why why is that our culture? Why did we inherit that? Why I don't I don't, I don't understand. This don't none of this shit ever makes sense to me. Um young man just trying to get a bite to eat. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Enjoy a day with his baby mama. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. I, like, I don't get it. Like, for me personally, it don't even make no sense. But why would she set him up? She ain't, she ain't got nothing to gain nothing. with him being gone. Right. What, what? What? She ain't got nothing emotionally, financially, yeah. spiritually. What, what possibly reason would she want to be at Waffle House and see this man robbed and shot to death? Mm-hmm. The mother, the father of her child. Mm-hmm. This don't make... That don't make no motherfucking sense. Right. It ain't, it ain't like he worth more dead than he is alive. He still had more, way more music oh. to make. Or is he? Now you know how these industry, how the industry get down, and they put the life insurance policy on in your ass, and then all of a sudden you smoked, and they get bread. They getting bread, but how much bread? Because like she ain't gonna be getting no. Oh more no, fucking. she ain't gonna get so the bread. So like, what what part would she have to play? I can yeah. understand them, right, but. What the fuck would she have to do with it? See, and that's why I, I agree with that. I heard so much going on after his death about, oh, it's her fault. Why did she post his location? That is that the calling the calling her out her name like this man was murdered right in front of her. She was there. She has nothing to gain, like Money Max says, at all. If you go out, and I'm gonna give, you know, always respect to uh Jay Prince. Because Jay Prince spoke on it. And he said, you know, it's a terrible thing. You know, and he, he said the same thing, like quit blaming the young lady. But if you go out, blinged out, shining, the jackers is out there. Mm-hmm. And it don't matter who you are. Like you said, you stick out like a sore thumb. You got to have security with you if you got a certain amount of paper. And if you want to be dripping like that mm-hmm. in public. Mm-hmm. That's, that's what our young uh, people with money and rappers don't do. They go out there living like it was before they got the bread. Now I got the chain. I'm on the floor. Somebody coming after you, man. Mm-hmm. 
Exactly. Because now you back, you back out there in the streets, you acting, you in the same area where you know brothers was hungry like that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's rats and roaches out to get you when the time come. I didn't want to speak on Charleston White at first because I hate giving that cat some time, man. But you are the worst part of this culture, bro. Bringing up other dead rappers, Biggie and everybody talking about fuck them niggas. They got took out because they was slipping. Like, bro. You are awful, man. You are awful. We talked about it on another show. You talking about teaching our kids how to be snitches. You saying fuck the other rappers because they weak and they got took out like they couldn't handle themselves. Like, who are you, bro? But a motherfucking con artist. Man, I hate that we keep giving you play and saying your name. You lucky ain't nobody trying to do nothing to you. God forbid, for real. But somebody do need to lump you up, though. That motherfucker got security. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, quick. He quick with the security. That Mm -hmm. motherfucker got security. Mm -hmm. Quick. But then you want to just talk about other people like that. Like, why do they keep putting a mic in front of you? This is the same thing I hate, man. I hate this even about social media. People give time and energy to listening to fools like that, man. This brother is dead. The yeah. other young rapper that got murdered at the cookie shop we spoke on. Oh, yeah, Young Dolph. Young Dolph. The same thing. Yeah. Rapper doing very well. He go, He's just out handling, just doing something easy. No security. Getting some cookies. Mm-hmm. Somebody came after him. Got him. But in this circumstance, that ain't the first time that was course. attempt on Dolph life. You right. You feel me? You right. Like... He he had multiple attempts mm. on his life. All the more reason to have some security. You would think, but right. you know what I'm saying? I, I don't yeah. but I guess uh a report was that uh he avoided a robbery or something the week before or some shit. Mm-hmm. I don't I don't know, something like that. I don't know, I wanna speculate, I don't like guessing. I got you. Um so I mean I ain't really got nothing else on it, man. It's a tragedy. It is. You know what I'm saying? For real, I just hate to see the slander of the baby Mizzle. That shit was wild. Like, yeah. I can't even imagine something like that happening. And motherfuckers blaming my wife. Like, oh, she man. set me up. Like, really? <laughs> like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, it just don't, it don't make no sense. Were, were the kids there as well? No. I don't know about that. Man, I, I, oh, man, I hope not, man, because that'd just be horrible. 